We should all be proud of our generation and the men and the women professional gathered here tonight. I mean women professionals too. I personally can point many of them in this room. Who raised the Armenian intellectual bar multiple levels from our predecessors by becoming engineers, scientists, entrepreneurs, doctors, lawyers, educators, musicians, and professors, architects, and successful builders. Our poor orphan parents who escaped the genocide could not have the education and did not have the mean or the parental guidance. And also they had to struggle with mediocre jobs to raise their families and make tremendous sacrifices to push their kids, all of us, to get educated. I salute our parents and grandparents and congratulate you all tonight from the bottom of my heart for becoming the phoenix of the Armenian nation. Thank you. We started uh, like with only a few of us and I'm proud to say that every year our membership has been increasing. Now we have also some members that exited, but they didn't just quit. What happened? They just relocated. And they promised whenever they come back, they'll come back. Certainly appropriated, and uh, hopefully he will not be overwhelmed. So keep on the donations coming. Okay? And we thank you a lot for that. Uh, some of the other uh, members that we have here in the, uh, involved with our organization, uh, we have Viken Bedian, who is was instrumental of, for this atmosphere here tonight. The restaurant and the logistics, great help. Thank you, Viken. We have been also assisted in this project by uh, Rafi Ulgiana. Uh, of what we've done this past year. I accepted with some trepidation because I realized that I'm the person between you and your dinner. <laughs> I have known Tavit for almost 20 years. This is one man I admire and love. But most importantly, he is a passionate Armenian. He loves Armenia and Armenians. A terrific organization with a very noble goal to help Armenia and Armenians in keeping their high uh, researchers, technical people within Armenia to do their research within the country and stop the brain drain, the brain drain out of Armenia. Sireli Nergenev, Metz Hajukov, Yev Harkankov, Gnergayatsunem says, Aiski Shervan, Mer Ambena Harkeli, Hürernis, Pacharik Hayaser, Jardarabet Doktor Tavit Najaryane. take this opportunity to thank AESA for this prestigious honor and I mean it 
sincerely, which has this, I have had many honors, guys, I'm telling you, and I'm very <coughs> proud and I'm very happy because I thought I deserved them, and I thought I deserved some more, but I didn't get them anyway. <laughs> All right? All right? This is a special for me uh, for two important reasons. Number one, recognition by my colleagues. You guys are my colleagues. We are brothers in ideas. We are brothers in profession. And it means a lot to me. Thank you very much. The second reason is recognition by an organization whose mission and objectives are greatly akin and parallel to those of the Armenian, Armenian National Science and Education Fund. The organization, which I and a few of the attendees in this room, and I will refer to them later, had initiated over a decade ago. Let me take this opportunity to acknowledge my very special partner in life, my wife, Sosi. I am telling you, she has helped me and she has given me, given flight to my dreams, my fantasies and my professional achievements and my philanthropic entropies. I also would like to acknowledge my late father-in-law, Mr. Kevor Kovnenya, and my mother-in-law, who honors me with their presence today. They both served as mentors and role, role models in all my attempts to be a humble servant of my community. Finally, I also would like to acknowledge two people, which is fantastic. Oh, no. I take it back. I, I'd like to acknowledge two people and a group of people. Two of my high school friends, unbeknownst to me, are here today to honor me. Wow. Dr. Ovanes Agopian, would you rise? And all the way from Toronto, Mr. Vani Kujan. Just imagine. We're talking about, oh, I don't want to say it, but I will say it anyway. We're talking about 35 years now, 35, 40 years. These people have not abandoned me, and thank you for being here. And unbeknownst to me, my son really played a trick, because this is an Armenian affair, and everybody that's at, at Nigerian Associates, that everybody has been with me, and have survived my harangues for over 30 years, and the average age over there is more than 30 years at the company, have brought everybody and anybody at Nigerian Associates, and I thank them for being here.